The first set of papers that starts your divorce is your petition and response, or in some states it's called a complaint and a response. The petitioner or the complainant is the person who starts the divorce. Those papers are prepared generally in the lawyer's office, but they're very simple. They include just the date of your marriage, your names, your children's names, and dates of birth. Those petition or complaint papers are then served on the defendant or the respondent, depending on what your state happens to call that person. To see those papers and to see it in black and white really makes it seem real, and that can be upsetting. If you're the person serving the papers, please take that into account. There are ways that you can have the papers served, sometimes through the mail, sometimes the other person can come and pick them up at the lawyer's office, and you may want to consider that. To give you an example, I once had a client who had the divorce papers served on his wife in a gigantic bouquet of flowers at her work. Instead of the card, it was the divorce papers. You can imagine how this woman felt, at first elated that she received a beautiful bouquet of flowers, and then to see the divorce papers with all of her co-workers around her asking her, oh, who sent you the beautiful flowers? You don't want to do it that way. Remember that the way you start your divorce and the tone that you set with that often is the way that your divorce ends. And if you'd like to reach a settlement, you'll start planting those seeds right at the beginning.